Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you don't know already, my name is Liz. I'm here. I make vlogs. I make videos about my life, what I'm going through right now. Currently, I'm in the middle of going through a divorce, in the middle of getting kicked out of my apartment, in the middle of packing, in the middle of a whole bunch of stress. Um, I have five kids and a nine-month-old baby. Um, one of my kids has autism, so that is a, um, a stressor for me. But Here's my life, guys. It's Saturday morning, and I'm about to go meet her dad at a store that's just a couple minutes away because she's going to go spend some time with her dad today, and I get some time alone. So let's do it. I'm down for that. <laughs> hey, cutie. So, guys, I'm on. you're supposed to keep the hat on. It's chilly. So, guys, I'm outside walking out to the van. About to go meet Jorge at Country Fair. Let's go. There's our moon, guys. There's our beautiful moon. Sorry, my finger got in the way there. But there's our beautiful moon. So, guys, I mentioned it in an old video, so you guys might not have heard it. Some, you know, people watching it now. But this is the map of Presque Isle. Um, where I go a lot and like make videos and you know, I take the kids there a lot too. We do a lot of fun stuff there like you know, There's like beautiful beaches and like Yeah, it's amazing and see where that arrow is That's where we are right now So the lake is Right over there So yeah, I don't know Jorge is not here yet. So I don't know what what his deal is. I don't know if he's coming or what so I'm just sitting here, Amore's in the back. Jorge's not here yet, it's like 8.29. So I don't know, I'm just waiting for him to get here. He said he was, he said he was coming, so we'll see. But I'm like anxious to get home because I have stuff I wanna do at home, you know what I mean? Like, I got stuff I wanna do. I wanna mop the floor today in the, in the, uh, oh, there he is. So guys, I am just, packing up some stuff, organizing some stuff, moving around some stuff, cleaning some stuff, about to take off. Oh, I already took off the shelves. Oh my God, guys. Whoa. So guys, one of the things I wanted to do today was go get my eyebrows waxed and um, maybe grab some hair dye. Um, I don't know, guys. I don't know if I wanna do that though. I don't even think it's needed. Guys, please excuse this, this this next clip. I had no idea that my head wasn't even showing, but this is just an example of how I cracked myself up. So yeah, please excuse that. <sighs> okay, so guys, I'm finally about to mop the floor now that Amora is with Jorge. Um, it's hard to do it when Amora is here because she's crawls around on the floor a lot and I don't wanna, you know, put the mop out and all that. and. You know, it's not a huge project, but it does take time. So, and I like to do things the right way, guys. All right, so Amora is still with Jorge. She's gonna be coming back soon now. She misses me. I know this because he called me and she was crying in the background. So let's fold, or fold this laundry. Guys, what the hell am I thinking? Let's mop this floor, y'all. So I did a little bit of a time lapse for you guys here so you can see what I did. I mopped the apartment and yeah, I got some OCD. So I gotta like do everything a certain way and you know, I had to move everything around and you know. Oh, you okay, babe? I had to pick up Amora there. She got a little crabby, so. My baby girl is so cute. She's just watching me edit. So, guys, I really want to thank you to, like, all my new subscribers and everybody that has been watching my videos. I really appreciate all your guys' support and 
the comments. I love reading the comments. Um, it's really awesome. So I don't know, like, I hope you guys enjoyed watching me clean. I don't know if this is, you know, is this like, it's kind of satisfying rewatching it now. Like I did a pretty darn job. Like, yeah, I do pretty good. I'm not going to lie. But, um, yeah, them chairs were greasy from like the kids Like there were so many like little, little kid greasy fingerprint marks. I'm sure any moms watching know exactly what I'm talking about. <sighs> so yeah, finally, that took a long time, but I finally did it. All right. So guys, I just got done mopping the whole house, the whole house. So <clears throat> the floor looks a lot better. It looks really good. And it smells good too, guys. It's a beautiful day out there. Oh, all those pull-ups. Even though he doesn't really need them anymore. So guys, I just posted my video, my vlog, and I was just listening to a tarot reading on here. And um, I think I'm going to go get my eyebrows done so yeah i'm gonna do some self-care so let's go oh guys jorge still has amora he kept her for some extra time um but i'm going to be calling him here when i have done when i'm done recording this to see where he's at um because i miss my baby and i want my baby back so yeah I'm feeling really good about, you know, getting my eyebrows done. I really needed that. So, hell yeah. Um, yeah, guys. So, I thought it was just funny. I just read a comment on my last vlog. And uh, somebody said, you get child support for five kids, so you should do just fine. Or you should be just fine or something like that. So, they literally, whoever this was, just assumed that you know they just literally assumed that i get child support for five kids which i actually don't get child support for any kids at all because which i don't owe you an explanation but it's called i share custody so when you share custody usually there's no like support paid so just a fun fact of the day um but yeah that's why it's good to not speak before you know all the facts and yeah so guys i'm freaking out a little bit now because jorge just called me and told me that he's on the highway on on his way home from geneva on the lake because he took the baby there which i'm not even happy about but he's apparently not even fucking feeling good i guess he said his heart's racing or something and he's not feeling good and he's driving i told him pull over and i will fucking come pick her up oh she's sleeping oh my goodness go over oh Okay. Did she eat? Huh? Did she eat it? Did she, she eat some? some? Yeah, she had some in there laughing. Okay. The juice, she was <laughs> but I didn't got a chance to, uh, I okay. didn't got a chance to give her a shower because we just came from the highway. Okay. Yeah. She looks so huh? peaceful. Hey, what? She looks so cute, peaceful. Like who? Like, she looks like... So Amora's home. She's eating her happy meal that she got when she was with her dad. Jorge took her to Geneva on the Lake today, which is a place over in Ohio. It's just right over the border. The Pennsylvania, Ohio border, basically. And uh well not too far from it at least. And it's you know, it's a like a magician, like you know, for magic. Since her dad is a he's a professional magician. So that's where she went today. She spent the day with him. And now she's eating. Look how adorable my baby is, guys. Like, look at her. I missed you. I missed that cute little face. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. So I wanted to show you guys something. So I think that this is really cool because usually, um, usually Happy Meals have, like, 
toys that are just annoying that I usually just end up throwing out. But look at this, it, and it came in a box. And I was like, what is this? It's in a box? Is it a book? And yes, guys, it's a book. Look, it is a little board book. This is so nice, and it's not even a paper book. Look, it's a board book. Look at this. Wow, and this is a good book, too, with all these animals. Yeah, I can't wait to read this to her. But isn't that cool that, you know, McDonald's actually put something, like, good in there? Like, like good toys, you know what I mean? Like, this is good. This is what we need more of. Right? Do you like your book? I'm sure, and Amora loves books. See, she's right, she's all about that book. She's like, yep, this is my book right here. This is my little green frog book. Nobody can take my little green frog book yeah. from me. Yeah. Or. Say, nobody can take my little green frog book. Say, book. Go. Say, book. 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 <laughs> She's watching how I had my mouth. Book. Book. Look. Book. 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 Yeah, I know you can do it. <coughs> Can you say mommy? You know how you say baba? You use that. Yeah, yeah, baba. Book. B -b -b book. <laughs> Can you say, look, this is a frog. Look, that's a frog. Look at my baby's cute little hands. Guys, look at how precious. Look at how precious my little baby's little chunky little fingers are. I love her. Oh, I love you so much. Look at these chunky little cheeks too. <laughs> what? Are you done eating? Ever since I gave you that book, you were, like, distracted. Oh, she, uh, yeah, she's not letting me take that book from her, y'all. She's like, no, you ain't taking... Oh, what? She's like, you ain't taking this book. <laughs> Are you done eating? What if I take the book to, to help to, so you can eat? Oh, no. Oh, okay, here, 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 here. Oh, don't, girl, don't throw a tantrum, girl. Oh, girl, I'm not... Girl, it's okay. Oh, my God. Don't throw a tantrum. Girl, girl, you do not throw a tantrum like that. That is not how you act, girl. That is not how you act. That is not how you act. Girl. Girl, we're going to have to have some discipline happening already because I see a little attitude happening. I see a whole little attitude. You just almost snapped on me there. What was that all about? What was that all about, girl? <laughs> Guys. <laughs> she almost snapped on me when I took that book from her. And she threw a tantrum. Amora's going to be such a good girl when she grows up. You're such a good girl now. <coughs> what are you doing? <coughs> You're my honey bun sugar plum. Pumpy, yumpy, yumpkin. You're my sweetie pie. You're my snickum, snickum, gun drop. Do, 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 do. The apple of my eye. 
and I love you so and I want you to know that we'll always be right here. So I love to sing sweet songs to you because you are so dear. Yay! I don't know if I sang all the lyrics to that right, but oh well. I know some of them are right, so that's all that matters, right, guys? Hopefully, I was showing my face in there. I'm just looking in the mirror now, and I'm seeing that I wasn't really having my whole face on there. But there's some cool stuff on the TV right now. Some background stuff. I don't know if there's noise to that or what. Wow, look how pretty that is. Wow. That's awesome. I want to go somewhere like that. Look, if I get a little bit closer, it's like I am there. Wow. Wow, guys, I was just daydreaming for a couple seconds there looking at that scenery. That was pretty cool. So guys, um, I just wanted to, you know, I just wanted to say this really quick. Um, you know, I noticed that um, my more recent vlogs are starting to get out there to more people. And I love it because you guys are leaving me the most beautiful comments. And they're really motivating me a lot. And they're really making me feel really good. So I thank you guys for that and also the people i'm also gonna thank the people that are leaving the negative comments because those negative comments are motivating the out of me to not give up no matter what comes in front of me no matter what comes in my way no matter what challenges happen all right <sighs> And I gotta say right now, guys, I'm going through like a lot of these changes going on in my life right now. But even though everything seems to be like falling apart, um, I'm feeling like the best that I've ever felt. Like I feel amazing. I feel confident. I can stand here and talk to you guys. I can say exactly how I feel. And I can take comments from people and not get angry. The fact is like people just, some people just don't wanna see other people happy because they're not happy. And I used to be like that too. But now I've completely turned around my way of seeing the world and I'm not a victim to any of this. I'm just going through all of this other stuff just like everybody else is. It's just how you choose to react to the things that happen to you. Look at this little cutie pie right here. She just chilling in her don't drop your cuppy. She's just chilling in her seat. Eating her last couple of little... Oh, you showing the camera? Oh, you're so smart. You're so smart. She's like, I'm eating my yogurt bites. And I got my milky right here. And I'm all changed and everything. Because we had a huge poopy diaper going on. Mommy reached down to get you and I got a whole poopy finger. <laughs> You're so cute. I got these little pants on her and these little socks. Little stitch pants. I'm not a big Disney person, but Jorge bought those. I bought this sweater. Of course, you would start trying to take that off when I say something. I bought this. It says, reach for the stars. Aw, look, honey. Reach for the stars. You're my star. You're my star. You're my star, my little love star. 
love you. I love you. I love you. I, I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. You love me. We're a happy family. Sorry, honey, you got a piece of hair. Mm. Look at that pretty, pretty girl. That's a very pretty girl. There you go. You wanna go lay down? Be easier to drink that. Go sit and sit in your crib. Oh, guys, I'm feeling a lot better now that I'm starting to get stuff done around this house. I'm finally pretty much caught up on laundry. I just have to put some in the dryer pretty soon here. I think it's almost done. I gotta put a new sheet on Amora's bed. So, guys, it's been a day. So, I called my kids at seven o'clock um they're with their dad and uh you know mariah sophie and bubba they're with their dad over the weekend and i called them at seven because when they're with that when they're with him i have a chance to call them at seven every night so i called them and said hi and then after i was done talking to them he like told them to go play or whatever and he tried to he was talking to me and i'm, I'm like okay what well, like he was like, I got to talk to you about something. I'm like, okay, what do you want to talk about? And he's like, um, I don't know. How do you feel about this new custody schedule thing? Because we just got it changed and the judge decided what it was going to be. And we got it sent in the mail. And I looked over it and I'm like, all right, well, whatever. I'm, I'm going to try it. I didn't have a problem with it. I was going to get a calendar and write the days. You know what I mean? A judge wrote it out. <laughs> what am I going to do? Like call up the judge and be like, hey, I don't like this. <laughs> so I'm like, well, you know, we didn't even try it. Like, you know, I'm thinking we didn't even try it. I'm like, well, I told him, can we just play it by ear and try it and, you know, just take it day by day? Because that's how I'm living day by day. And that's how I'm, you know, like just like this, I'm pulling out my phone right when I feel like it. I don't care if I don't have makeup on. I don't care how I look. If I want to talk, I'm going to record it. So, what was I at? So, he's saying that, you know, he thinks that it, he doesn't like it and such and such, blah, blah, blah. He doesn't like the way the new order is, even though it's 50-50 it's still. It's just the days are, like, switched around. So, apparently, he had a problem with that. I told him you know it's you know let's just try it and he's like well just to let you know I'm gonna be talking to my lawyer and I'm gonna be filing again so you know this is just I, I'm not worried or anything like that but you know I don't think the judge is really gonna go for that because he's the one that just decided what it was <laughs> so you know this is just something that you know I have to keep in my thoughts, something I got to write down. I have to like, you know, just remember this type of stuff because, you know, we didn't even try the the new schedule yet. And he's already making a problem about it, calling me and, you know, this is just unneeded drama, like un not drama, but like just unneeded, like we didn't even try it. We didn't even try the custody order yet, the custody schedule, the new custody schedule. Let's try it. Let's try it, bro. What's your problem? <sighs> so, hey guys, I'm recording with the camera on my laptop. I'm just, you know, seeing how this is working out. And um, so I didn't record an outro last night, but I'm going to record this for you guys right now. And... Yeah, hopefully you guys like this vlog and I'm going to be having more real, real, real soon because there's lots of stuff going on, guys. All right. So thank you for watching. I love y'all. Bye.